Welcome to my Ball Sports Midweek Predictions. Big Tuesday and a big Wednesday of football action. Uh, www.ballsports.com forward slash Stan for all of our fantastic offers, including the Crossbar Challenge, of course, which has been extremely popular this season. All of my columns, all of the fallout from uh, this weekend just gone and the midweek. So ballsports.com forward slash Stan. Lots of offers there. We want to make sure you come away from uh, every match day with a few quid in your pocket. Let's go to the midweek predictions, if we may. Let's start with Burnley against Stoke City. Uh, Burnley, of course, having lost against Tottenham Hotspur. Decent home record. Very good home record they've got overall this season. But no win in the last six for the Clarets. They face a Stoke City side with one away win in the last eight. I'm going to go for Burnley to win this one uh, by the odd goal. Burnley 2 Stoke City won. If you're looking for goal scorers, Sam Vokes came off the bench late on against uh, Tottenham Hotspur. Uh, maybe Jeff Hendrick from midfield and uh, Miriam Duf uh, for Stoke City to maybe reply again. He came off the bench for Stoke City in their uh, defeat at the weekend. At this time of the season, of course, you're looking to utilise your squad. Lots of knackered players. So players that have come off the bench for 20 minutes, 30 minutes here, there and everywhere. They may well be pivotal to your team achieving their aims and ambitions uh, for the remainder of the season. Why? Because they should be fresh. Burnley 2, Stoke City 1. Let's go to the champions of England, Leicester City. Craig Shakespeare, congratulations to him. I used to clean his boots. The uh, first English manager in Premier League history, uh, no less, to win his first four games. I believe this will continue. They face Sunderland, tail of the tape again. Sunderland won away win in their last eight. Uh, I'm going to go for Leicester City 2, Sunderland 0, which will put almost that final nail in the Sunderland coffin and keep uh, Leicester City moving forward, of course as they look to uh, have competition for places and form ahead of a huge quarter-final of the Champions League against uh, Atletico Madrid. Leicester City scorers, I'm going to go for Jamie Vardy and Damari Gray. Watford against West Bromwich Albion. Watford's form, one loss in their last four games at home. Uh, West Bromwich Albion unbeaten in their last four away. A uh, good result for West Bromwich Albion at Old Trafford, so they are, are very used to in the last five or six days and over the last four or five weeks uh, getting results away from home. Um, I'm going to go for them to get a win. I know that Watford are decent at home these days and particularly their form has picked up recently. I'm going to go for Troy Deeney to open the scoring for the hosts at uh, the Vic. And I'm going to go for Solomon Rondon and James McLean, uh, Ireland's finest, uh, to uh, seal the winner for the baggies. Watford 1, West Bromwich Albion 2. Uh, Manchester United against uh, Everton, one of the classic big games in uh, English top flight football. Manchester United with too many draws, we know. I think they're unbeaten in the last 18 uh, games. Uh, and Everton coming off the back of, I think it was a very disappointing uh, performance in the Merseyside derby, a game, of course, that they haven't won for 18 years. Uh, they haven't got a great record at Old Trafford, there's no doubt about that either. But I think that if Everton and, and Ronald Koeman are serious about attracting players, about getting a feel-good factor back for Everton, that they, with a talented squad, have to go to Man United, knowing that United have had lots of draws, so there's nervousness and edginess, uh, abound at the moment uh, Old Trafford as they can't seal the deal they cannot put teams away is that Everton will go there and win this is my big prediction of the week uh, the midweek Manchester United nil Everton won and that man Romelu Lukaku that was mightily disappointed he needs a big performance against the big team I think it will be at Old Trafford maybe his next employers should uh, Everton look to sell him uh, in the summertime Manchester United nil Everton won